Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Ark Ascended. <laughs> I am Zystars, we are still on the island, and we have now a couple of Rexies. A female and a male. Now, I could have swore I tamed them both at level 135, but the one came out to 202, the other one came out to 217, so I'm not sure what happened there. But regardless, we now have a couple of Rexes that we're going to put together for breeding. And I think we are going to put together a breeding pen right down here somewhere. Mm. You know, I did foundations, a whole crap load of, of them. I'm going to make a little a circular thing, but I don't know if this is the right place for it. It's not exactly flat. I mean, it's flat-ish, but I would really have liked to have a flatter area. But they're Rexes, so I need a flatter area that's a little big. A little bigger than normal. Which would suck that I put up... No, that's not going to work over there either. Honestly, the best spot is like right where I have the dinos right now. For a breeding pen, because this is like the flattest spot. Maybe I'll move all of those goons over to the other side. Ooh, okay. We could do that, and then I, I'd have to move Pooh Man, too. We could put all the dinos... Jesus. We could put all the... Well, if we put all the dinos over here... We did have that Alpha Raptor that spawned down there, and that would be a huge drag. Ah, to hell with it. We're gonna do it right here. This is a flat-ish spot. Let's see, let's see how big we can get. Okay, now, I've never done a spiral on this map before. Or on this game before. So, I don't know if it's the same. I've done it on Conan. But I've never done it on Ark. Alright. Now, you go like this. On Conan, you can do it like this. Okay, so it looks like it's going to be the same. Cool, okay. So let's grab... What's my weight at? Okay. You don't need as many... I don't know why I made so many of these. You don't need as many of these as you need those. Okay, our weight is a little high. But it should be good. Alright, there we go. So this isn't pretty. Oh, that is very large. <laughs> that's a That's a big-ass door. <laughs> Okay, so this ought to do the job. Uh, you know, I might put, I might put a man door in. I might do that. I might put a man door in. Um, so that the big door isn't always what I'm opening to get in and out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that. So we're gonna need some regular walls, and a regular door, and then we'll put the man door in. I I made way too many. I made way too many. Just we just too many, but that's all right because I'm sure I'll use it at some point. Oh, I have doors. <laughs> I can do that. Those are the doors for my trap. That's what those are for. Oh, I need a or not doors. Those are the walls. I need an actual door. Now this is uh da, 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 crafting door. Stone, wood, and th I should have figured. All right. This is basic. So this is what I, I drag it over. I drag half back. I drag it over, I drag half back, and then thatch weighs nothing, so I just drag it over, if I can find it. Alright, door. And that usually gets a pretty good spread of everything, of the stone and, and wood, because it costs roughly twice the amount of stone as it does wood for a stone building piece. And then just a bunch of thatch, so th that makes it real easy. Uh, let's put the door... We'll put the man door right here. Because I want it pretty simple to go through. All right, pick up the wall. Now we'll go here. We'll go door. And we'll go wall. Just to make things kind of even. All right, and then we'll make sure we go through the door. Okay, we can go through the door. Number five, we'll drop that on. We can still go through the door. Okay, and this way... The biggest reason I'm doing that is for the Oviraptor. I'm going to drop the Oviraptor in there, and I don't want the Oviraptor... I don't want the Oviraptor to, um, what do you call it? I don't want the Oviraptor to, uh, run out any time that I go in there, so. All right, uh, da -da -da dinos, dinos, let's ride male Rex, hit T. 
All right. Now, breeding in this game, it's it's the aspect of the game that I dislike the most. Come here, turtle. Um, well, it's I guess the breeding's not bad cuz it is kind of neat to get babies. But the part that I dislike the most is the damn uh What you doing? Is the uh mutations. But that's because I'm impatient. Okay, you're a dead carby. And you had the thing, which means you have babies. That is a tough carby. Level 50. Okay. Let's get these guys in here. Hey, hey, Rexy Pants, move your... Oh my god, she's already in me. She can't wait. She just can't wait. Alright. Come here, you. No, where are you going? Oh, which one of these is the dude? Okay, so this is a girl. So the girls are going to sit out here. Wow, I can push them that far. Now, I'm going to push them all the way in because, number one, if an alpha raptor does spawn, it's not getting up here. And number two, I want to have as much room as possible in his mother. All right, so... And then the male is going to be back here. Roughly in the center, so that when I get more ladies, they'll go on left and right. All right. Uh... We'll leave these guys on neutral. I don't want them running around, but if something gets in, I don't want them to get killed. All right, so Lady Death Strike. Behavior, enable mating. Behavior, enable mating. Whoa! Behavior, enable mating. Also, where's the dino looking? Disable dino looking. Copy settings to nearby Rexes. Bam. Okay, none of them should look at me now, and they're all making babies. All right, sweet. Now, I gotta go get my bird. We're gonna go grab the Obi Raptor and drop him in. Where is... Where is Eggs Benedict? There he is. Since he's not grabbing unripened eggs, at, like, at all... He's not grabbing them from any of these dinosaurs, so we're just going to assume he's not going to grab eggs. Um, I think what I'm going to have to do is completely block in the area for the dinos and then let him run around, which is kind of annoying, but all right, eggs Benedict. Now let's double check his, his stuff. All right, so let's give him some more weight. Oh, he did grab eggs. Oh, sweet. What'd he grab? Trike egg and a Rex egg. Oh, handy dandy. Sweet. Currently mating with Rex level... Yeah. How long does that take? Okay, it's getting there. He should pick up the eggs and hold them for me. So I can just leave these guys on mate, and I'll come back in a little bit. That is so cool. Okay, so he did pick up... So we need another Ovi Raptor. We got eggs. We need another Ovi Raptor to let him run around out here and pick up eggs. Wait, did that say a trike egg? I don't have any girl trikes. I th I thought my trikes were all dudes. We got some nature will find a way stuff going on. Male. Male. Oh, there is a female! Ah. Oh my goodness gracious. I am just a complete tool. Alright, no big deal. Alright, bird, you hang out here. Uh, you're still grabbing Poo Man. Hey, you again? What did I tell you? Stupid Pteranodon. Oh, I don't have any bullets. Sweet, so we got the uh, thingamadoo going. I am excited. Alright, let's go put these eggs in the fridge. Man, all this time, and that guy only grabbed three eggs. Yeah, I definitely need to to pen these guys in somehow. Crappy part is, I probably have to widen this, put a behemoth gate up. Um, Probably come over here and run foundations all the way around the edge. 
have to run foundations. Not foundations. What are those things called? I don't have them on me. Run them probably in front of that rock and all the way to there. And then this is probably fine. Probably knock down all these resources. And that means they're not going to spawn, which kind of sucks. But maybe go up the river so that these guys are blocked in from the river. Oh, you know what I need over there? I need... I need a feeding trough. Alright, uh... Trough. Here we go. Eight metal. Eight metal, thatch, and wood. One of these should, should last, or not last, reach the entire thing. Did I just pick up a poo? I did. All right, let's grab that. Yep. Well, you know what? I cleaned out all of the meat from inside those guys. Man, that one I got on Dino Island, it was so hard not to pump points into that thing, but I'm told you don't want to pump points into your dinos that you can use for breeding, so... I resisted the urge to add points to it. I just used the bird to kill everything. All right, can I move? No. Oh. Man, these are T-Rexes. They're going to need food. Um. All right. Ooh. Ooh, the bird is heavy. I'll probably put this right next to the man door. That way I can bring food in easy. Oh, and they dropped eggs. I didn't even look to see if the if the dude grabbed them. Nope, 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 nope. Close that. He's not moving. Oh, he grabbed him. Is he not wandering? Oh, nope, he's wandering. All right, he grabbed the eggs. Fantastic. All right, six. We'll drop this right here. All right, perfect. And let's grab the meat. Come on. There we go. Obi Raptors eat meat, right? I'm going to need more meat. Oh, that's. No, here we go. 190. Right, you stay in here. All right, now let's do this. Check the feeding range. Okay, it looks like it's outside. Even on the far side. Looks like we're good to go. Oh, yeah, look at that. We could have extended this. <laughs> oh, I need. I should probably put some pillars there. Look at... <laughs> okay, it barely reaches this side, but it reaches. So we're good to go. All right, sweet. All right, so here's the idea. We got the taming pen in here. Now, I left the ground like this because babies tend to clip into foundations as they grow. So we're going to leave this kind of open, and I just want walls to stop the babies from wandering and stop, uh, excuse me, Bing Bong from getting in. Now, I made some air conditioners. I don't know how well they're going to work. I'll probably turn them on. What's, what's my temperature right now? Uh, da, 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 16 degrees Celsius. Turn on. Stand next to them. Temperature is now 16 degrees Celsius. I have no idea if they work outside or not. I might need to put a roof on this place. If I do, the roof is going to look kind of weird because I don't have foundations. So we we may reassess, but I think I think this will work for now. We'll we'll see if that doesn't work. I mean, I know you can tame dinos with with campfires, so I don't know why you would need a roof. It should work, right? All right, the Rexes have about another... That's a lot of purple berries. The Rexes have about another hour and a half before they're ready to, to do the Devil's Tango again. So we're going to let those guys get um, at least two more eggs, and then we'll we'll go hatch babies. What are you? Oh, that's from the Kestroid. Where did my bird go? There he is. Jump! My bird's got all sorts of building materials on him, so... 
We're gonna go offload that boy oh. That was pretty good, man. We we got a Rex Maiden. We got some Rexes. Oh my god, I am so excited that I simply cannot hide it. You need to get a little closer. And I have enough stone pieces. I went a little nuts with the stone. But we had a lot, so I figured why not? Can I make sweet veggie cakes? I should check and see. That way we can actually tame that Ovis. Alright, uh... Can I reach this? Not that one. There we go. We'll go upstairs after we're done here and... Oh, that's a lot. We'll see if we've got the stuff to make sweet veggie cake. Is that 120? Yeah, that's a lot. Alright, let's drop those in there. <gasps> we're out of space? No. How'd that happen? Give me the beer. Beer. The beer. I haven't used the beer barrel on this mod or on this version of the game yet. Um. Hey, you know what? There's nothing right here. Let's see. I, it should be irrigated without any problem. What is it? Wheat? It's berries. Bear, red berries? Ba I don't think the berry color matters. It's berries and... Thatch? I think it's thatch. So let's grab... Not that many. There we go. Let's grab that and grab some thatch. And I know I need to make... Like a glass jar or something. Oh, I can't have that in there. Okay. Uh, We're going to have to reassess our... What was that? You little bastards. There we go. We'll see if that does it. You, go away. Silly bird. Alright, let's throw the beer in here. Oh, I already did. Okay, and we've got a little bit of that. We can throw that in there. Sweet. Fantastic. Look at that. We got meat just hanging out over there. It's just chilling. Oh. What what was that? It's a tickle chicken? Okay. Where did you spawn up here? Oops. Uh huh. Ah, level 40. One of these days. 35. One of these days I'm gonna have to get a, a tickle chicken and start breeding them too. Because you don't fight the dragon with uh with with T-Rexes. That would just be no bueno. No bueno any bit at all. You know what I should do? I should throw a couple of, at least one light in that thing for when the generator's running. That way we, it can be light out when we're doing the babies. That's not a bad idea. Where's my... Do I have one? Not in there. Uh, I do not. Okay, what does it take to make an omnidirectional light? Here we go turned on let's make let's make two i need to repair my other two of these can i i need polymer i have to go visit the penguins again all right i could set up a penguin farm too which is just terrible like you set up a bunch of penguins to breed and then mercilessly mercilessly slaughter the babies when they come out it's it's quite something to watch all right, and let's put a light here. We'll put a light over here. All right, and we'll and we'll we're we'll turning those on when it comes time to to raise the babies. All right. Well, the base is coming together. What? I wonder if we should expand this area at all. We're gonna need another another container at the very least. Maybe I'll do a container for armor and weapons. And then this one will be just for, like, various building materials, because I seem to be a little out of control with that. All right, um... We have edgy cake. I have got everything in here except giant bee honey. Hey, hey, dude. There's poop all over the place. What's wrong with you? You're just crapping all over the place. Okay, so I saw... 
a big old bee over there. I've been looking around for a friggin' hour, it seems like. So let's put this on. And we'll eat that. And we'll put our kibble. I think it'll only take one. Uh, He should be fine. I didn't see any predators. There's a bunch of foamia over here. All right. Hey there, queenie queen. Queenie queenie pants. Did you see me? Oh. Did you not did you not care about my 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 hiddenness? My hiddenness doesn't work for you, queenie queenie pants. They're too fast like Are you going to attack me? That thing looks like it's going to attack me. The babies aren't coming after me. But she's acting all weird. I've never done this before. I hope I don't die. What is that noise? Hey, Queenie Queenie Pants. Where did you go? There you go. Came. Holy crap. They're all mine? Sweet, I guess? Now what do I do with it? Aggression level. Oh, is she... Are your drones dying? Tracking info? Oh, obtain a beehive. Uh, do I do that now? Can I do that now? I have a beehive. Sweet. Okay. That wasn't hard. It just it just took forever. Hey, hot dogs. Yeah, I probably should. I probably should, but I'm not going to. Sweet. All right, let's get back to base. All right, back at the base. Let's put our beehive down. Now, I wonder, do I need anything with... Whoa. Okay. Do we need to put something in it? Provide rare flowers to keep the hive healthy. All right. I think I have some rare flowers. Uh, I have a few. Give me a little bit of honey. Then we can make some sweet veggie cake. I, mean, I am going to have to find more rare flowers, but... I'm having a hell of a time finding rare flowers since the beaver dams don't seem to spawn. Single player. That single player life. Probably should have just done this on a server. Ooh, I better go put my kibble away. You don't want to waste that. I mean, it's got a couple of day timer, but there's no point in, in risking losing the losing out on the kibble. All right. Put our armor back on. The giblet suit looks nuts. Uh hat and boots no and gloves yeah there we go there's our there's our mishmash uh oh you seem to be out can i move nope can i move eh. seem to be out i'm just doing the one i'm not in a hurry for metal so that's why i'm just kind of letting this burn you know slowly and grab all that stuff if i need metal i'll fill up the other four but so far, we're good. All right. Oof. So we got a beehive. We got our Rexes. I, I I lied. It wasn't quite an hour. They're not quite... Or it wasn't over an hour. It seemed like an hour to find that stupid bee. Um, But they're not quite ready to mate yet. So maybe next episode. Uh, I tweaked the settings for baby imprinting. So I hope I got it right. So I think we're going to do just one baby at first so that I can make sure the imprinting speeds are good to go and the maturation speeds. I don't want it to take, you know, four hours for me to mature a Rex. Like, that's ridiculous. But I also want to be able to do the imprinting because that's going to give us some extra stats, which is going to be important for going to the Broodmother, which is going to be our first one. Now, which one of these do we have? We have the Artifact of the Clever. So that means we need the artifact, what, of the, is it the hunter? Let's go to the brood mother here on my little cheater, cheater, cheater page. Clever. So we need the hunter and the massive. So in order to get the hunter, I think that's the hard one. 
The lower south cave. Okay, so the hunter artifact is right here. Okay. And then what was it? What was it? The massive is the other one? That one is over here somewhere. On this peninsula, which I apparently didn't mark last time I went there. On the on my um, or maybe I no, I had to have gone there because I did fight the broodmother once on a multiplayer game. Anyway. Ooh, how are we doing? Nothing yet. So we got to do those two artifacts. Um, I'm going to look up a little bit on the cave because I know they've severely limited the dinos since we don't have cryopods. So they severely limited the dinos that we can take in. So I know a Baryonyx is a legit choice. I just haven't gotten one yet. And Kermit's X is always going to be a good choice. The only problem with Kermit's X is those damn bugs knock our armor off. Though those caves it's not going to be that big as big a deal because arthur polaria that's what they're called because we're not going to get off the damn frog so i might just leave armor off and just go in and get those that might be a good thing to do then we'll have those three um and we'll be ready to do the brood mother once we get these t-rexes tamed or not tamed raised it really is kind of rough once you raise them you gotta level them which is oh it takes so long without cryopods you can't just fly from location to location which is kind of bad you know it, it sucks but it is what it is all right ladies and gentlemen i think that's going to cut this episode i do hope you enjoyed it if you did please do me a favor hit the like button subscribe to the channel for a little bit more content maybe come in the comments section and share that video with your buddies because youtube says sharing is caring and as always everyone i do hope you have a great rest of your day shut up and sit down